Well, good evening, Liberty family. I thought I, <laughs> I thought I saw you clicking on the video. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> cause I'm a stalker. <laughs> well, good evening, Liberty family. How are you today? Nice Sunday day today, isn't it? Hope you got the, uh, hope you got the word in with Pastor Buddy. I'm just here petting my friend. His name is Poof Poof. Yes, well, it is an honor to to bring the word tonight. Uh, looking forward to it. Got a good one for you today. We're going to open up in five minutes. <laughs> what was that? All right. <clears throat> well, hello there, everybody. Oh, look at this. Ugh. <laughs> Well, hello, Liberty family. How is everybody? I'm just here with, with Poof Poof, just enjoying the Sunday evening. Welcome to our 6 p.m. Uh, gathering here at Liberty Church online, coming to you from here in the basement, of course. And uh, it's still weird that we have to do it this way, but I'm glad to see you have, have clicked on and... Uh, are get are getting ready for the word today, or for this evening? Poof, poof! I'm just gonna have to put you down, right there. Poof! Very good. Hope you've had a great day so far. Hope you were able to watch the adult service this morning with Pastor Buddy, and just got to have some good family time this week. How about we do this? How about we take a minute, get comfy. You can either light the fireplace up. Get yourself a hot chocolate or a coffee. Grab your Bibles. Grab a fuzzy blanket. And uh, we're going to have a good time. All right? I'll give you a few minutes to get comfortable and get ready for tonight. I'll go get your coffee. <laughs> and I don't need anything. Just give me a cup of water. Don't ask what's that. It's lovely. <laughs> well, welcome back, everybody. Hopefully, you got your coffee, a little drink, as I do here, as we get ready to start off tonight. Hope you got your fudgy blanket, your pajamas on. However, best you want to do it, get a snack, get your dinner, whatever you want to do. It's kind of a joy of doing this from home, as you can kind of just get. It's kind of just. Be however you want to be, you know? Well, let me give you a few announcements here really quick. And oh, I've been told by Andrews and not to take too much of a time up because as soon as this is done, uh, there may be a short break. There probably will be. I don't, I don't plan on going too long. It'll be a break, and then at 7.30, Kids Night Out will be live as Andrew starts his new series entitled I've Got Issues. Because well, the bottom line is we may try to hide our issues, we may try to deny our issues, but everybody's got an everybody's got issues. Oops. Say I've, I've I've looked at it and it's pretty good. <laughs> no, the bottom line is that everybody's got issues, uh, no matter what the issue may be. Everybody's got issues. So that will be tonight at seven thirty. I, I know what Andrew's going to be talking about. Uh, it's going to be a good one. It's, it's definitely a big issue that a lot of people have, especially your kids have. So get the uh, get the tablet, get the laptop, get the phone to uh, to the kid for to your to your children for an hour or so, and uh, get ready for that. That'll be right after seven thirty. Of course, t Tuesday is of course Pastor Zoom, uh, Pastor Jared's Zoom meeting. Uh, get in, in contact with him. He's been doing his apologetic videos, which definitely go check out. Shout out to Pastor Jerry. Definitely go check those out. 
uh, always filled with good information as we explain why we believe what we believe, which is important, and First Peter talks about that. Uh, Wednesday, the food pantry. If you missed out last week, the food pantry will be back, uh, as far as I know. If not, Pastor Buddy and Pastor Eric will have to correct me on that. But they, they, as far as I know, they will be out there on Wednesday again from 1 to 4.30. Uh, I do know that you have to wear a mask. 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 Just so everybody knows the rules, you have to wear a mask. And no getting out of your cars for anything. Uh, they've got it towards a drive through type system. Volunteers will have gloves and masks, and they'll bring the, car, the food out to the cars. Almost said the cars out to the food, but that would be impressive. But they can't do that. And then Wednesday, we have the, uh, the Zoom. Not the Zoom. We have Facebook Live with Reverend Knight at 7 p.m. And we uh, also on Wednesday, I don't know why I said Zoom. I'm planning on having a uh, another Zoom chat with the kids, probably about 12 p.m. again, just because I'm off on Wednesday. Um, so I'll get the information for that as well. Tuesday and Wednesday, we'll have devotionals. For the kids as well on the kids youtube page one will be the last one with chippy bam bam toodles and yang yang and the other will be another pioneer devotional thursday is the master's messenger master's messengers what? <laughs> thursday, what? thursday is our bible study for the men via zoom uh the master's messengers make sure you get a hold of pastor buddy so he can get you on that list to get you that contact information of uh, the guys who've been doing it. It's been a wonderful, it's been a beautiful, beautiful time. Uh, getting in. <laughs> it's been a, uh, the guys who've, who've been a part. It's been a beautiful, beautiful time uh, as we gather and get to get into the word as men. And yeah, so definitely get a hold of that. Get a hold of Pastor Buddy with that. And then Saturday will be our another, I'm sorry, not Saturday, Thursday. Thursday also. Thursday also will be the final Proverb devotional for the kids as we'll be reading Proverbs 30 and 31 on Thursday, April 30th. Uh, the last announcement I want to make out, <laughs> the last announcement I want to make is on Wednesday, May 28th. That's the final Wednesday in May. Lord willing, we'll be back at the church before then. Um, but just to kind of end the quote unquote school year uh, and kind of as a, as a fun activity before the summer begins um, I ha- I want we're going to be doing a, ca- a talent show for the kids and teens so as they're home and as they're stuck at home yes they're doing their school but hopefully they're getting a chance to kind of work on what they're good at whether it's singing or dancing or acting or, or whatever you know magic tricks whatever it may be uh, it'll be a time to Show us the church for gifts and talents because everybody's got a gift, everybody's got a talent. And uh, I, I think it would be awesome to see the kids and teens use those talents and display them because uh, we shouldn't be keeping those secret. We should be using those. Uh, so that will be Wednesday, May 28th. That will be our, our, our Wednesday night service. If for some reason we're not back by then, we'll figure it out. Uh, but either way, that will still be happening in some shape or form. Uh, I do have a backup plan in mind for that. Also, really quick, in June, you know, we, we're supposed to be having camp, and VBS will let you guys know all the updates for that here in the next couple of weeks as we uh, continue to look at that. All right. Well, before we get any, before we get started, let's pray really quick, and then we'll get into our our, our study for tonight. And then we'll be good. All right. So let's pray. God, I thank you for tonight, this wonderful Sunday night, as we're able to gather together in our homes via uh, electronics. We're able to still come together and learn about you. Thank you for a good day so far. Help us have, Holy Spirit, just have your way in the service tonight. Give me the words to say in Jesus' name. Amen. Well, tonight, tonight, let me get a drink here. Uh, tonight's topic I'm going to be talking about it was heavily was heavily inspired by my sister Allie and a conversation I had with her which kind of sparked the the whole girl power devotionals um, 
that I've been doing on Wednesdays for the kids. But I want to I want to talk to you guys because this these ones that I've picked, um, I believe relate to adults a lot, uh, and, I, and I've called it Wonder Women. You know, uh, looking at some of the women of a Bible. Um, and yeah, you know, cause women, uh, I'm a huge nerd. I like superheroes and star Wars and, and, and Disney and, and all those aspects. We have these, these strong women, whether it's a Disney princess like Jasmine or Snow White or Ariel or Rapunzel or Elsa and Anna or whoever it may be, or it's star Wars where you got Leia and Padme and, uh, Ahsoka and, or, or Ray, um, and even in superhero in DC and Marvel, you got Black Widow and Scarlet Witch and gosh, there's a lot. And uh, Wonder Woman and Batgirl and on all these guys, there's all these heroic, strong women. For Sunday, for tomorrow night, for the adults. Because because he's told because buddy well buddy first told me it was gonna be we were gonna rotate like we have been, and I said okay, so he had me do Easter, and then last week he's like, Pastor Austin's gonna be speaking again. This is last week he said this. He's like Pastor Austin will be bringing a word tomorrow uh, next week, and I was like what. And I texted him, I said, I thought you said we were going to rotate it, and it's supposed to be somebody else, because it was Eric last week, okay. and I said, <laughs> I said, I thought we had it set where rotation would be 